Right now, your landscape sucks, but why? You spend hours creating it. Well, that's the reason why it sucks. The truth is, you need a realistic height map. Let me show you how to fix it and get a realistic result with only one texture. So here we are. Height maps are free and obviously there are paid ones. For just playing around, you don't need to pay any money. I link you the site and um, yeah, they are pretty good. Also, they come with color, but um, you don't really need it. So the whole point of a height map is you just get the height information. If you want to spend some money, just go on ArtStation, go in the shop, look for terrain, look for height maps. And most of the time you also get like EXR files or PNGs, some uh, high resolution images, stuff like this here. So when you have your height map, you don't need to import anything into Unreal Engine. Just start the engine, go onto the selection mode or shift 2 so you enter the landscape mode. As you can see I have nothing in my scene, um, only ultra dynamic sky for the sky and the overcast. And in the landscape mode you just go under manage, new and then import from file. And in the height map file you just click the little dots and then navigate to your map. So. For me, that would be this mountain range height map. I don't use the diffuse PNG. I'm not a fan of that. I want to create my own textures if I'm using stuff like that. But as I said, that's not in this video. I will mention that at the end. So just get your height map, open it. And right now we have a rough preview of the terrain. And as you can see, it's quite huge compared to the clouds. So for me, it's a little bit flat. And that's a cool thing, you can just change scale before import. So let me put that on, I don't know, maybe 700. And now we get an updated preview on how it would look. You could also just click fit to data and then um, it would align based on the image you feed it. For me, that works. So I just did import and let it do its thing for a few minutes or for a few seconds. It depends on the map and the size. So <laughs> because of the fog, uh, it looks like nothing happened. So let me see if I can disable the fog real quick. So I disabled some fog and uh, it's a little bit better. However, it still gets the point across. So as I mentioned, it's intended that there is no color. You want to create your own material. Just keep in mind, you should create a real landscape material for that. So set up some real textures. Don't use the included diffuse only. Some height maps also come without any textures. And now focus for a second, let me know in the comments below if you're interested in a guide on how to create your own height maps. Also if you're serious about working as a game dev on your own game or if you just want to work at the game studio, make sure to join my free group where I teach you all of that stuff and other game industry related knowledge I learned over the last 10 years. With that said, here is the video about how to set up a basic landscape shader in Unreal Engine 5. Enjoy!